After you've placed a pace order, you'll notice in progress control that the status of the paces changes. Initially, all of the paces were prescribed, but now you'll see that the first three paces in every subject have had their status changed from prescribed to ordered. Once you receive a pace order at your school from ACE, you'll want to go back to the inventory screen and receive your order. Click the arrow in the drop down box here appears, select the order that you've received, and then click receive all items. This will take the paces that you've received and check them into progress control. If for some reason you did not receive all of the paces, you'll have to manually fill in the quantities what was received if an order a pace was omitted from your order. Let me go ahead and click on receive all items. A confirmation box appears. I click on receive order and now when I go back to progress control you'll see that the status of the first three paces in each subject has changed once again from ordered to in stock. Once a pace is in stock if you right click on the pace you can issue that pace to a student and once a pace is issued to a student they complete the work in the pace take their test then you can go ahead and enter a score by clicking in the score box and let's enter in a score of 95 and then for her first English pace we'll give Christy a score on her first English pace of 100%. You'll notice when I click on the next pace it automatically issues. Once we have scores entered we can go ahead and print congratulations slips. To do that click on the reports tab on the left which opens up the report screen. You'll notice congratulations slips here under academic reports. I click on the congratulations slip. My start date was today. Since I want to include all of the paces that were completed today, I'll make my end date tomorrow. It's important that you change the date to the next day because the calendar reads on a 24-hour period and to make that work correctly you need to select an end date of the following day. I'm going to just print a congratulations slip for Christy. I select her name and when I click submit you can see that the congratulations slip appears with the appropriate information here her algebra one pace and her English pace let me try to make that just a little bit larger algebra 97 with a 95 percent English 1097 with a 100 percent I'd go ahead and click print which would send that to the printer the congratulations slip would be printed and be ready to hand out to the student